So are you looking to instantly make your videos look more professional? Well, in this video, we're going to talk about the best Final Cut Pro plugins for the year 2022 that will instantly make your videos stand out. Hi guys, Bennett Grazer here, and today I will introduce you to my top five favorite plugins that I use frequently when it comes to editing videos in Final Cut Pro. It's a good idea to invest in some high quality plugins that will not only make your videos look better, but also save time in the long run. Keep in mind that all the products mentioned will be in the video description below. So with that said, let's get started. So starting with plugin number five is Color Finale 2. If you enjoy color grading in Final Cut Pro, Color Finale 2 is a professional color grading tool that extends the functionality, giving you advanced color grading tools to work with for better video results. The standard color tool in Final Cut Pro is still very powerful and I use it in combination with Color Finale. Personally, it helps me speed up my workflow, making it easier and faster to color grade my footage. Some of the best features in Color Finale 2 is the ability to preview different LUTs before applying them. This gives me a good idea of which LUT would work best for the type of video I've shot. Now, if you're like me, you can use Color Finale 2 to create and export your own LUTs and even sell them on your website. I've done an in-depth review on Color Finale 2, which you can check out up here if you're interested. So let's continue with plugin number four, which is Neat Video. Uh, this is a professional digital noise removal. Final Cut Pro does come with a noise remover, but you get far more better results using Neat Video as it's extremely effective in cleaning up your video, especially when filming in low light situations, you're more likely to encounter digital noise. On smartphones, it's even more apparent because they don't do well in low light situations. Here's a video shot on the iPhone X using Filmic Pro's Log V2 picture profile. And if you look closely, you can see the digital noise in the shadows. And after applying Neat Video's denoiser, you can immediately see that the noise in the shadows has been completely removed making the video look much better. I do use it from time to time and like to apply it to my smartphone footage to increase the video quality. It also has other features such as removing flicker and imperfections that can be useful as well. Neat Video can be a lifesaver, but for the price of $130, it isn't the cheapest option, but it will certainly help make your footage look better and will save you time not having to reshoot the video again. Moving on to plugin number three is M Callout High Tech by Motion VFX. If you haven't heard of them, Motion VFX are one of the leading creators of plugins for Final Cut Pro and other softwares. They provide top quality tools such as templates and effects for video editors. It's easy to install and works seamlessly. Now with the M Callout High Tech plugin, you will get 30 modern looking callouts, which I use for all of my tech reviews because it gives it a professional look. In my reviews, I often have to name the item and can easily do that by dragging the title layer on top of the footage and adding the text in the layout. You can change different parameters to create the look you want and also comes with built-in tracker that will connect the text with the object, which gives it a really cool and stylized look in your video. Moving on to plugin number two is Production Crate. Now, this isn't really a plugin, but what I like about their service is that they provide production ready assets for the video making community, whether it's music, graphics, or visual effects. And a lot of their assets are also available for free for you to use. The pro version costs around $50 a year, which grants you full access to all items. I've been working with their research for a long time and I still use them today. A while ago, I made a video on how to film and edit a teleport effect on the iPhone using the portal effect from them, which got over 300,000 views. So if you like having special effects in your videos, you can easily use their assets to do so. You do need a bit of experience to blend in those visual effects, but Production Crate do have a lot of tutorials online that will guide you step by step. Coming in with plugin number one is M Title Glitch by Motion VFX. Now, like I mentioned, I love using their plugins and they also include uh, title animations. Now, if you haven't noticed, I use the M Title Glitch throughout this entire 
entire video, which really gives it a modern touch to it. Instead of having to learn how to use After Effects to create your animated title, you'll save much more time using one of their title plugins. I went for the M title glitch as it has a sort of futuristic look uh, to it. I just recently got it, but I can already say that I will be using it for my future videos here on YouTube. Now, a pro tip I have for you when it comes to using title plugins is to make sure to include sound effects to make your animated title come alive. I use a lot of my music and sound effects from Artlist, which I think is the best place. You can get two months for free if you sign up using the link in the video description below. Now, Motion VFX also offers other great title plugins that you can check out. For example, M Title Cinematic 2 is what I use in all of my travel videos, such as the one you've seen from Egypt, uh, Portugal, and Turkey, which really adds that cinematic feel to it. So with these plugins in mind, make sure to take advantage and use those plugins to save time, be more efficient, and improve your videos. Don't think that you have to do everything by yourself. If you don't have the money, check out some of the free plugins that Motion VFX offers to get started. Maybe you will find something that uh, might be of good use to you. Now, if you're new to my channel, I would appreciate it if you would subscribe so that I can create more valuable content for you guys. Make sure to also leave a like if you enjoyed this video. If you have any further questions, make sure to let me know in the comments. I read all of your comments and also answer back. So do that. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.